Have you ever wondered how the traditional Spanish dish paella is made? Welcome culinary enthusiasts. Today, we're exploring the vibrant, flavorful world of paella, a hallmark of Spanish cuisine. Originating from the eastern shores of Spain, paella is more than just a meal. It's a celebration of culture, a feast that brings people together. This delightful dish, steeped in history and tradition, is a testament to the rich culinary legacy of Spain. Stay tuned as we dive into the rich history and the delicious recipe of this Spanish culinary masterpiece. Scene Script Spain's vibrant culinary scene would be incomplete without paella. Originating from the beautiful region of Valencia on Spain's eastern coastline, paella is more than just a dish. It's a testament to Spain's rich cultural history and a symbol of unity. The name paella itself comes from the wide shallow pan it's traditionally cooked in, known as la paella. Now picture this, it's centuries ago, in the lush, bountiful fields of Valencia. Farmers and laborers are working under the Mediterranean sun. Come midday they gather around a fire, cooking rice in a flat pan, adding in whatever they could find, rabbit, duck, snails and beans. Yes, you heard right, the original paella was far from the seafood spectacle we know today. It was a humble, rustic dish, dictated by the seasons and what was available. As time passed, this humble dish began to evolve. The coastal Valencians added seafood, those inland included rabbit and chicken. The use of saffron, the world's most expensive spice, was introduced to give the rice that distinct yellow color and unique flavor. Today, paella has crossed borders and oceans, becoming a symbol of Spanish cuisine worldwide. From roadside eateries in Spain to upscale restaurants in New York, this versatile dish has found a home. Each version has its own charm, reflecting the diversity and creativity of those who cook it. With such a rich history, it's no wonder paella has become a globally loved dish. Now that we know a bit about the history, it's time to gather our ingredients. Our shopping list includes short grain rice, a pinch of saffron for that distinct flavor, chicken, rabbit for the traditional touch, green beans and white beans. Don't forget the olive oil, water and a sprinkle of salt. If you're a fan of seafood, feel free to add it into the mix. With these ingredients in hand, we are ready to start cooking our paella. Cooking paella is an art, and every step is crucial to its flavor. Let's dive right into this culinary adventure. First off, we need to heat some olive oil in our paella pan. Once it's shimmering, we'll add our chicken and rabbit pieces. These meats are traditional in authentic Valencian paella, and they add a depth of flavor that's hard to beat. We're looking for a good golden brown sear on all sides. Next up, it's time to introduce our vegetables. We've got a colorful medley of green beans, butter beans, and bell peppers. Let's toss them into the pan, stirring them around so they get well coated in that flavorful oil and browned meat bits. Now comes the star of the show, the rice. It's vital to use a short grain variety, as it absorbs the broth beautifully while maintaining its structure. We need to evenly spread the rice across the pan. Here's a pro tip. Once the rice is in, we don't stir it anymore. This helps to develop the sokarat, that deliciously caramelized layer of rice at the bottom of the pan that's the hallmark of a great paella. We're not done yet. Now we'll pour in the saffron-infused water. Saffron lends an incredible aroma and a lovely yellow hue to the dish. Again, no stirring. Just let the rice absorb the liquid as it simmers. The final step is to let the paella cook undisturbed. This is where the magic happens. The heat does its job, the flavors melt together and the rice becomes tender and flavorful. Patience is key here. Good paella is never rushed. And just like that, with a little bit of time and a lot of love, we've created something truly special. From the golden crust of the socarat to the aromatic blend of saffron, rice and meats, every element comes together to form a symphony of flavors and textures. And there you have it, a beautiful, flavorful paella ready to be enjoyed. It's more than just a dish, it's a celebration of Spanish culture, a feast for the senses and a true culinary delight. So, that's how you make a traditional Spanish paella. Born from the heart of Valencia, this dish has journeyed through time to grace our tables today. The beauty of paella lies in its versatility, with a multitude of ingredients that can be tailored to your personal taste. From the sofrito base to the saffron-infused rice, each step contributes to the symphony of flavors that is paella. 
Remember, the best paella is the one made with love and patience. Happy cooking!